When I was a little boy, I painted um, almost every day and they always thought I was going to be a very great artist. Then my father died tragically young uh, and I was 13 uh, and uh, I stopped dead in my tracks and I didn't paint in any meaningful way for the next 40 years. And then four years ago, I had what I can only describe as a, an emotional and spiritual awakening. I awoke one morning with an all-consuming need to paint, and I found that I had stored hundreds of abstract images in my head, uh, and that I had a story to tell, a big story, of 225 paintings. Um, at the exhibition in Cork Street, which opened on the 7th of June, I um, unveiled the first 75 paintings, the first chapter of a three-part um, story, 75 paintings each. The very first painting I painted when I went back, appropriately, was this painting, which is called Genesis. The paintings are autobiographical. They also deal with philosophical and psychological concepts, um, which are to do with, uh, they link into the development of individual and collective consciousness in the world, and they also go through um, a historical sequence. This painting, um, Genesis, is what you would expect. It's the beginning of it all, and it, it reflects the eruption, not only of humanity and life, but also the eruption I felt when these images came flooding back to me. Um, they're deliberately, it's deliberately shown in a almost televisual way because um, I was a television producer um, and I love colour and I wanted this um, story and these images to be very modern. So that was the first one. Um, after Genesis, um, what um, I next explore and reflect is the um, happy state in which we as human beings exist, and I certainly existed as a child, um, close to my mother's womb uh, and bosom, and that is the state of empathy, where there's no distinction between subject and object. You are whole and you are very comforted and cosseted. In this painting here, I do a series of um, seven paintings in my work which um, are called Empathy, and I use the colours of the rainbow as I do through all my work. In many series, I will go through and explore the theme by doing a series of seven with the different colours. Um, other, other times, I often do a series of three. Now, what happens next here after we've had the period of empathy is man starts to look out. Man starts to see himself as um, a subjective being and there begins to be the separation of subject and object and we begin to look beyond ourselves. And the way that that's represented in my art is um, in a series that I call um, Optic. Um, this, there are a sequence of three optics. This is the first one. It's the... Um, the sea and the stars, the eye looking beyond. Um, I then do um, a second one, which is very much rooted in earth, um, but again, looking beyond. And then this one here, which is the third optic, which is um, over here. Um, and you're beginning to get um, more refined and subtle views of looking to the world. Um, Beyond this, I explore this notion of a tightening of, um, uh, of, of, of objectification uh, in a series called Reductio and Principia, where ma man's perception of the world is becoming more sharply defined in the outer world.